Hey everyone, Eric from Body Fit again. And this week we're going to talk about myofascial release and a couple different techniques you can utilize to help release some of the tension throughout, uh, throughout your body. And today we're going to focus on around shoulders and neck area. A lot of people carry a lot of tension in that area. And what that means is that restriction in that area is what we have around every muscle is what we call fascia. So the fascia is what gets tight and dense and restricts the movement and what we perceive to be tightness or knots in our muscles is really tight fascia. So trigger point release, utilizing either a foam roller or what I'm gonna to use today, a lacrosse ball, can help you uh, loosen up some of that tissue and we're gonna focus around the shoulders and neck today. Um, I have a lacrosse ball, you can use any type of ball. This is nice for around the shoulders because of the size of it. Around our shoulders we have our shoulder blade, our collarbone, a lot of bone in that area, obviously our spine. So this is nice to get into the muscles around that area a little more intricately than say a big foam roller would. Um, so how you would do this, you just need the ball and some wall space. And all you're gonna do is you're just gonna take the ball and just put it behind your shoulders in and around your shoulder blades. Okay, and what I'm gonna do is I'm working on my left side. I'm gonna take my left arm and just bring it in front of my body just like this. That helps expose some of the muscles in the area. And what I'm doing is I'm just moving the ball around until I find sensitive areas. And you'll know them when you feel them. And these are the areas we perceive to be uh, knots in our muscles. And when I find those points, I'm gonna hold on those points for about 20 to 30 seconds, and then continue to move around. In total, accumulating two to three minutes in and around the shoulder, and then I would switch sides and go to the other side. Um, so it's a great little tool to have. Um, if you travel often, um, you can store it in your bag. Obviously, you know, spending a lot of time sitting in hunched positions, say in the car or on a plane, it's nice to have as something if you do need that little bit of a release for when you get where you're going. Um, otherwise, it's just a great nifty little tool. You can pick up at any sports store, Walmart, Canadian Tire, they're about six, seven dollars. Uh, it's a great investment. Uh, give that a shot, let me know how it goes.